Hey guys, so we're back again. Today we're going to be doing one of these little bistro crostini things they're called. So basically you take the pastry, put it in this little aluminum lined cardboard deal, put it in the microwave for however many minutes, and then it's done. What we're going to do today is we're going to do it up in the air fryer. So I'm going to go on bake. It says 350 for 30 minutes, so I'm going to see how it's going to work on 375 for 25 minutes. Um, another thing, make sure that your tray is on the baking, baking line. So here we go, I'll put this sucker in there. We'll fire it up. And we'll be back shortly. Okay, so we're back and it's been in for the whole time. Let's pull it out, see what it looks like. To be honest, it's not really as crispy as I would like. I'd like a little bit darker. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lift this up, put it on the air fry level. Close this back up. And we're gonna do it on air fry. 425, it's not gonna be in for 15 minutes. Cause I just want to get the outside nice and crispy, nice and dark. Um, one thing I did forget to say is this thing was frozen before I put it in. This little crostini. So we'll see uh, how long it takes to brown up, basically, and uh, we'll be back again. Well, it looks like it's starting to bleed out, so I'm not even, it's only been there for one minute. And I'm going to stop it, and I'm going to call it done, regardless, because as you can see, the cheese is starting to drip out of it. That's going to make a dang mess all over my oven. So with that being said, pull it out and time to enjoy. So obviously it's been thawed out and well cooked. So now I'm gonna chow. Thanks for watching. Comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.